quarters, please. Hello. Good evening. I want to report a robbery at uh, Mrs. Frederick B. Updike's house, 13 Sutton Square. Thank you. What's your game? What does my game appear to be? Now, let's get down to cases. You're the guy to pull the updike job. That's a very logical conclusion. All right, wise guy, and you're trying to unload the stuff. Well, you're catching on marvelously. Okay, Joe, make a deal with this guy. He's getting in my hair. Come on, now, let's talk turkey. I can't get over it. You deliberately committing a robbery. Four. Four perfect crimes in four weeks. Hey, get that light off me. What's the idea? Oh, uh, just an accident, old man. Nothing to be upset about. Yeah, well, don't let no more accidents happen. I ain't no guy you can push around like these other dopes. Shut up. My confession won't hold water, but I'm going to keep those coppers entertained until you can get to him. The professor. The professor? Take that dumb look off your face and listen to me. The professor is plenty hot. Get up to his office right away. Tell him to blow town fast. Get out of the country. Try and keep your eyes open. Look at me. You see me as if you were looking through the wrong end of a telescope. You see the walls of the room waver and sway. In a moment, you will have a sensation of falling in space swiftly. You'll hear a rushing sound in your ears. about other people's insides. Why don't you put your stethoscope on and listen to my heart? Maybe you'd like a sample of my blood. Oh, don't be a fool. Let me out of here. Run! 